Prison time for a Terrytown woman convicted on a meth distribution charge. KDB.TV News starts right now. From your trusted source for news in western Nebraska and eastern Wyoming, this is KNEB.TV News. Presented by Platte Valley Companies, premier provider of financial services. Hello, I'm Ryan Murphy. This is KNEB.TV News, powered by Platte Valley Companies. Thanks for joining me. In our top story, a Terrytown woman who was found guilty on drug distribution charges following a May bench trial has been sentenced to prison. 56-year-old Tina Sanchez was arrested in November following a traffic stop where a canine helped officers locate 10.8 grams of suspected methamphetamine, a glass pipe with residue, and a digital scale. Sanchez stood trial on May 13th on charges including possession of meth 10 to 27 grams and no drug tax stamp. And on June 25th, Judge Andrea Miller found Sanchez guilty on all counts. On Friday, Judge Miller sentenced Sanchez to a total of three to five years in prison, and with it being a Class 1D felony, she'll have to serve a minimum of three years in prison and won't receive any good time for early release. Well, earlier this summer, a Scottsbluff County District Court jury found a Scottsbluff woman guilty on charges stemming from a February knife attack. And last week, 43-year-old Josefina Gonzalez learned her fate. On Friday, District Judge Leo Dobravoni sentenced Gonzalez to two to three years in prison for second-degree domestic assault with a dangerous instrument and two to three years in prison for use of a deadly weapon to commit a felony, plus $5,000 in restitution. She was arrested this past winter after officers made contact with the victim at Regional West, who said Gonzalez had cut him with a knife, resulting in 13 stitches. Gonzalez was ordered to serve the sentences consecutive to each other, but did receive 134 days credit for time already served. And Governor Jim Pillen and University of Nebraska leaders honored the first group of students selected for a new program aimed at increasing the number of production animal veterinarians in the state. The Nebraska Elite 11 Veterinarian Program, which was announced in February, offers full-ride scholarships to students specializing in working with livestock such as cattle, swine, and poultry. Pillen says these young adults are making a commitment to themselves and the state. Each one of these young students have the opportunity to have their entire education uh, scholarship. And their return, what they have to give back is an eight-year commitment. Eight-year commitment of practicing in rural Nebraska in production animal medicine. Uh, if they fall short at seven and a half years, they owe eight year they they owe their entire they owe their entire scholarship back. One spokesman from the class, Sydney Hutchinson from West Point, says this program is an incredible opportunity to keep Nebraska talent in state. This is a pivotal moment for Nebraska students looking to pursue a career in production animal veterinary medicine. We truly appreciate the investment in us and the future of the state of Nebraska and its agricultural industry. One of this year's inaugural students for the veterinarian program includes one from the panhandle, Hannah Keelan of Dix. We'll have more news right after this. Looking for free instead of fees? Platte Valley Bank can help you keep your finances moving forward with no ATM fees. Whether you're headed to the lake the mountains or just to the grocery store you can enjoy the freedom of free atm access anywhere anytime platte valley bank you belong here Back at so last week, 350 runners had registered for this year's Monument Marathon, with runners from South Korea, Kenya, and 34 states getting registered. WNCC Alumni Relations and Stewardship Director Elena Hahn wants you to be aware that the price of registration will be increasing starting September 1st. We have a corporate challenge for the half 
marathon relay, which mm -hmm. is a three-person relay. There's still time to get signed up for that, and then there's a lot of room in the 5K, and if you're ambitious and want to do the half or the full. The race is Saturday, September 28th, and people can register online at monumentmarathon.com. And the Scottsville Police Department has been recognized for excellence in training management by the nation's leading provider of policy, training, and wellness support for first responders and public servants. This is the second consecutive year Scottsville Police Department has been recognized by LexiPol, whose program tracks Scottsville Police Department's performance on five metrics proven to measure success in training management. They achieved bronze, bronze recognition for consistent and effective online training management, which includes training hours assigned and completions tracked, personal engagement, and external training activities logged. Life is crazy. Pain is stressful. How can anybody concentrate with these busy schedules? Now you can. This is Ben Moravec coming to you from HydroZen, a float therapy business right here in Scotts Bluff. I'm here today to let you know we now have memberships for $49 monthly. You can guarantee yourself at least one float per month. You know how floating keeps your muscles relaxed, your joints relieved, and your brain clear to think? Now you can float at a reduced rate each month. Inquire today at hydrozenfloat.com or call us at 308-63-FLOAT. Hydrozen, unplug and recharge. I imagined retirement in a place where we could enjoy our golden years, where adventure and friendship are the only items on the schedule. The Garden Homes at Northfield gives us the luxury we planned for and peace of mind when it comes to convenience, safety, and comfort. We never have to stop and think about the day-to-day -day upkeep. We love to explore abroad, but most importantly in our backyard. So much to do, so much to see. Here at Northfield, we get the protection of life care, incredible tax benefits, and secured rates for aging services. It's peaceful, knowing that if our needs change, we'll be taken care of. And most importantly, that our kids will never have to make any tough decisions. There never seemed to be enough time to do all the things we wanted. Now we get to focus our energy on enjoying what this community has to offer. At the Garden Homes, life is ours again. A place we had dreamed about. A chance to focus on us. Tri-City Stormwater presents Stormwater 101, an illicit discharge. This is KNEB.TV Ag News. From the Scotts Bluff Body and Paint Ag Desk, Scotts Bluff Body and Paint, you're driving home our reputation. Good morning. The 2024 Nebraska State Fair officially underway and Caitlin Evans of Bertrand joins us and you were working hard on your animals. But tell us more about what you brought to the fair this year. Um, I brought my market heifer. Um, I don't really know. She's pretty relaxed and she's just fun to work with and easy going and I don't really know. She's just easy. What's her name? Texas. Texas. Love yep. it. Okay. Um, what does it take to prep an animal for fair? Um, basically what I do with her is I just take her to the wash rack and like to soap her and wash her and stuff and then I'll like blow her out and then I'll do like clean sheet on her and that's it. I imagine throughout the year there's yep. a lot of work that goes into yeah. her. What does that look like? Um, basically you repeat the same thing over and over again and it's just like an ongoing thing so and then you just have to get them out every once in a while to work with them. And yeah. Good deal. Yeah. What's your favorite part about being in fair? Um, just being interacted with the animals. All right. Tell me about um, your grade in school. Are you in high school? Uh, I'm a senior. A senior. Yep. Okay. What are you planning for for the future? Um, just to stay back and work. Good deal. Yep. All right. All right. Caitlin Evans joins us. She is from Bertrand showing at the Nebraska State Fair this year. We'll send it back to you. 
The incredible renewal by Anderson dog days of summer sale is here and I will sit up and shake for this one. It's the best offer ever for new windows and doors. Please listen to this. You get 20% off, an additional 5% off if purchased on the initial consultation. No payments for 24 months, two whole years, no payments. Please visit rbawyoming.com. Call today to schedule your free in-home consultation. Don't wait. This deal ends August 31st. Two years, no payments. That's doggone awesome. Welcome to Kelly's Liquor, your liquor cabinet. Whether you're a wine enthusiast, a whiskey sommelier, a tequila connoisseur, or you just love your beer, Kelly's has the best selection of what you're looking for. Family owned and operated since 1946 and right on 27th Street in Scotts Bluff. Come see us today at Kelly's Liquor, your liquor cabinet. And remember to be a good neighbor. Don't drink and drive. Kelly's Liquor, West 27th Street in Scotts Bluff. Let's take a look at your community calendar brought to you by Riverstone Bank. The community calendar is brought to you by Riverstone Bank. We're local and we love our community. Better sleep and better health can be found at Western Sleep Medicine in Gary. Since 2006, Western Sleep Medicine has offered the lowest cost sleep testing, either in their independent sleep laboratory or the privacy of your own home. You have control over your health care and your out-of-pocket costs. All insurance is accepted for a much lower cost than the regional option. If you need a sleep study, ask for Western Sleep Medicine. They've helped thousands of people over the years and want to help you. Western Sleep Medicine. Better sleep, better health. Tired of feeling stuck? Not sure if you are on the right track? Platte Valley Bank can help keep your finances moving forward with checking account options to fit your lifestyle and an online account chooser to make finding the right account easy. Control your financial future with helpful budgeting tools and automatic savings plans. Now is the time to enjoy the ride with Platte Valley Bank. You belong here. And finally tonight, some exciting things are happening at the Leeds Scottsdale Public Library as they kicked off their adult reading program Monday. This year's program is called Adventure Begins at Your Library and will run through October 18th. Library assistant Ethan Nelson says there's a lot of great events and prizes for 2024. We have more than 20 events this year plus um, uh, activities such as reading specific books, using library resources, and we have a lot of great prizes this year. We have eight adventure prizes, including an air fryer, a Fitbit smartwatch, an emergency radio, a power bank, 
and we're really excited that our grand prize is going to be a $600 gift card to Sunny's Bike Shop. To get signed up and find out more information, you can stop by the library on 3rd Avenue in Scotch Bluff. Well, that is it for us this time. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay safe out there. We'll see you here next time.